Steganography is the technique of hiding secret data in a non-secret data file. The advantage of steganography over cryptography is that the secret message does not attract any special attention. No one would ever know that a picture contained a secret message by viewing the file either electronically or in hard copy. In this lab, Use Steganography to Hide Data, you will use Steghide, an open source steganography program, to hide a data file within an image file. Step 1 is open a terminal window in the CSE Lab VM. Launch the CSE Lab VM and then double click the terminal icon to open a terminal. I'll increase the size so it's easier to view. Step two is to review the files that will be used for steganography. Enter the CD downloads command to change to the download folder. And then list the contents of this folder. Here you will see a file called keyboard.jpg and another file called secret.odt. Enter the command LibreOffice secret.odt ampersand to open the file. LibreOffice opens. And you can see our message here is the secret document. Exit LibreOffice, file exit LibreOffice, and then hit the enter key to get a new command line. Now to look at the keyboard file, enter GIMP keyboard.jpg and then ampersand. To open GIMP. And this is the file that we will hide our secret message in. Close GIMP. I'm going to File Quit. Step three is to use Steghide to embed the content of the secret.odt file inside the keyboard.jpg file. At the command prompt, Enter the steg command, steg hide command, followed by the following content embed, and then the options cf, keyboard.jpg, followed by the options ef, then secret.odt. You will be asked for a passphrase. I'm going to put capital Cisco and you get the message that the embedding is done. You can open the files again to see if they've changed. Nothing has changed in the secret document and let's look at the keyboard file. Nothing that we can see has changed in the keyboard file. Step four is to verify that the secret.odt is hidden in the keyboard file. Enter the command steghide info keyboard.jpg. At the command prompt type Y and then enter the passphrase Cisco. And you can see that the embedded file secret.odt is embedded inside the keyboard.jpg file. So step five is to extract the secret.odt file from the keyboard.jpg file. Enter the command steg hide extract with the options SF 
and keyboard.jpg. Again, enter your password, Cisco. I must have entered the password wrong. And it will ask you if you want to replace the secret.odt file that already exists. Just say yes. Then open the extracted secret.odt file. And you will see that the secret is still there. 